hello you guys and welcome back to my channel uh if you are new here my name is Kari Nari and on here I we talk about various fragrances we talk about fragrance layering I spotlight fragrances I talk about hauls that I may have gotten um I thank you for stopping by I hope you enjoyed this video uh we we like to spotlight different things that we do enjoy. And when I say we, it's because I believe that this is a community where you help me give you what you're looking for. Uh, please leave comments, chat, say something inside of the comments. I love to communicate back and forth with you. It enables me to be able to get to know you more better. And plus you can make new friends, right? Uh, today's topic is going to be about a fragrance that I have been wanting to get my hands on and I finally got it and that is the last or the most recent installment by AI the Great, A More Infinity. Let me start off with say that I do really enjoy it and if you're interested in knowing more about it, then please stay tuned. If you like what you see and you enjoy this, I have playlists. I have multiple fragrances that I've discussed over the time that I have been on YouTube. Please hit the playlist. Watch what you are interested in from fragrance layering to fragrance reviews. I have everything for you on this channel. But let's get into the latest installment by AI the Great. If you're interested, stay tuned. All right. I want to first jump into packaging, packaging, packaging. Oh, I love the packaging, right? So you're going to get this beautiful case, which I know you probably have seen already before if you've gotten any of the AI fragrances uh, from Navitus. But you're going to get this package right here. So it's a hard, it's a hard case. And here is the bottle. I know that is absolute. I mean, it just looks like it's going to be good, huh? <laughs> I know, I know. And here's the bottle itself right so it's like this pale pinkish color uh very similar to like a bubble gum type tone to it uh i love the the largeness of this particular packaging right here and i think more fragrances should come out like this from navitus uh it's worth the price because you get so much right so it's not your typical uh, size that you would get of any other other ones it is a 4.2 ounce uh, you would normally see like a 3.4 ounce for with someone else. So think of that when you're thinking of the pricing. Uh, but just absolutely gorgeous. So if you've seen her other fragrances, then you know how this one is, right? So that's packaging. That alone. So I'm going to take out the notes. You're going to get the notes on uh, a little small card right here. And we're going to go over these notes uh, shortly. So I wanted to give you the package. I wanted to show you the bottle. Now, let's talk about the scent. The scent is so, to me, it is absolutely perfect. Like it's a perfect fragrance in a sense of it gives you just enough girliness, uh, sass to it, along with a little, a little gourmet, not too heavy. So let's get into the notes, right? So the notes in here is going to be top notes of red fruit, pomegranate, grapefruit, bergamot, and pineapple. And then the heart of the fragrance, you're going to get rose, honeysuckle, orange blossom, and jasmine. And then in the base is where you get this white chocolate, vanilla, driftwood, heliotrope, and sandalwood, right? This, uh, the atomizer is a very great animals. I hope you was able to see that. For me, it starts off like this nice berry chocolate, not that thick, heavy chocolate. So this is not a dark chocolate. Like I said, it's white chocolate that's in this fragrance, right? So it's like a chocolate um, ness to it, almost sweet. Uh, reminds me of like a white chocolate bar with berries, right? So this is like a very elegant dessert. But that doesn't really stay around very long. It's almost like a peek into the fragrance. You're just going to quickly move into that red fruit. So think berries, right? Red berries, your raspberry, your um, 
little blueberry-ish, but not a blueberry scent, but like a really juicy berry tone. Uh, the pomegranate, um, I did, I was so excited when I saw that note because I really don't have pomegranate in my collection, right? But I didn't really get a lot of pomegranate. What I did get was this fresh grapefruit, like citrus note to it, right? The pineapple is not uh, a syrupy pineapple fragrance. I have yet to decide where this is going to fit um, in my collection. I do believe that it's going to fall under my berry uh, scents, but right now I'm just really trying to get into it. Oh, but it's the dry down for me. It's the dry down for me. It starts off, like I said, that chocolate, but then it turns into this really nice, pretty scent, like a really pretty scent. Um, and like for me, it reminds me of Della, uh, Delena Rosé with a mix of Bronco, uh, Blanco Latte with a base of a love tuberose by Amaros. <laughs> I really hope that makes sense, but that's what it is to me. It's like, if you are a layering queen like I am, right? And I would take all three of those scents and spray them on my body, but I don't have to because it's inside of this fragrance right here. Um, a more infinity. And I love that the white chocolate is not a heavy chocolate. Right, the heliotrope gives you a tad bit of powderiness, um, not like lipstick powdery, but a tad bit of powderiness. And the sandalwood, the sandalwood is woody. It's like a woodiness. It's not creamy sandalwood. It's a woody sandalwood, but it's not a lot of white floral. But I would say that you have to like white floral to like this fragrance. Uh, because of the uh, jasmine, the orange blossom, and the uh, honeysuckle. So you kind of, you really have to like a white floral to even be able to get into this fragrance. But it's so nice. It's It just reminds me of a beautiful spring day. Like a beautiful spring day, not too hot not uh kind of cool breeziness it's that early spring that's what this reminds me of early spring right where winter is finally leaving and and it still has a bit of a, like a nice breeze in the air but it's not yet really wet or damp or or um over floral like you know it's not it's not inter it's not exactly spring it's that middle part i hope that makes sense to y'all right it's the middle stage like i'm so happy i got it i don't know what i was waiting on right i kept putting it off and putting it off to get it um but i got it i got it now and one thing i can truly say about the collaboration that alicia has with navitus is it's beautifully done. It's really beautifully done. I really feel like now she has kind of like got into a good build. So for me, uh, if you haven't heard of the other ones, I will post the video that would tell you of my thoughts on the first two when they came out. Uh, this is the third installment of it. But the first one was, um, what is on my... I'm sorry, y'all. Something is on my bottle. Uh, first one was Ambrosia Imperial. This, to me, was the banana gourmandness, right? So this is a fall scent for me. And then she came out with uh, Amorous Intense. This is jo Green Jolly Rancher Apple Freshness. Uh, so to me, this is summer. This is summer, right? And now she came out with a, a more infinity. And this is my spring. 
All I'm saying is, come on, AI, you got to give me a winter fragrance because then I have something from your line that I can wear all season. I can wear any of these all season, but that way I, I can pull a different fragrance. So in my mind, if you're wondering what is Claudia Nari's thought about the new installment from uh, AI the Great and Navitus, I think they hit a trifecta. I think this is a gorgeous trifecta of fragrances. You have a little bit of everything. I enjoy it. I really do enjoy it. I believe that you ought to get an opportunity to try it. Uh, I think that now you have a chance to, depending on what your fragrance like is, there's something for you, right? there. There's something you can pull just from the collabs for uh, AI the Great that you can go with, right? Um, Ambrosia Imperial, um, Amorous, um, Amorous Intense. Now you have a more infinity. And the cool part about it is have y'all noticed that all of her fragrances has AI? There's an A and an I. <laughs> like, think about it. She put a lot of a lot of thought into these things. And I really think that you all should go out and try it. I will make sure that I link a Navitus um, link so that you can go ahead and go to the Navitus website. I don't get anything from it. I do believe that Navitus should reach out to me and give me something so I can give y'all a discount. But I don't have one currently right now, right? So I'm just giving you the website for where you can go and get these fragrances um, and keep your eye out. Make sure you are following um, AI the Great. She normally posts her discount code and you can get it at a discount. I think I saved maybe 10%. I think I use AI the great 10, um, if I'm not mistaken, or AI 10. Uh, and I got 10% off this purchase. But at one point in time, I think when it first came out, you couldn't get as much as 30% off. Um, I think that is a beautiful fragrance and I think y'all should really try it. Um, this was a spotlight, a spotlight that was geared towards the newest installment for AI the Great collabing with Navitus. And I hope that I've shared everything with you. If you like these type of um, videos where there is not long, it's kind of to the point. I'm just basically telling you what are my thoughts? What is the new fragrances? Make sure you give me a smiley face inside the comments and talk back and forth and tell me, what do you think? Do you have this fragrance? Have you added this fragrance to your collection? What did you think about it? Are you as much in love with this fragrance? Did it give you another one that you can wear throughout the season? Because that's what I feel like I got. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Uh, please stay tuned for any all the new videos that I have. I hope you have subscribed and you've turned on your notifications so that you don't miss any future videos that I come out with. But on that note, I'm going to bid you a wonderful night. Anytime, day, night, whenever it was you had an opportunity to watch this video, I appreciate you and I will see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.